Happy Halloween from us here at Ordnance Lab and of course Buddy who's um, reluctantly here in the video. I know, very fascinated by stuff. This is our Halloween episode. We've actually filmed it. Okay, Buddy wants to go do something different. We've got our pumpkins here. Uh, well, pumpkins and then looks like a pumpkin that has herpes or something like that that we found at HEB. But what we're going to be doing with this right here is going to be a just like our video we made with the mailboxes where we blew them up. What we're going to do is we're going to take some mailbox or the pumpkins and blow them up, starting off with a uh, cricket bomb. Then we're going to go on to a pipe bomb with Buddy trying to like hog the camera there. Then we're going to do a hand grenade, a stick of dynamite or ready prime, and then a TNT charge. We actually originally already filmed this out at my ranch, but unfortunately Skynet wiped out our memory card and so we lost it so we had to refilm it here so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and head on out there and we'll start blowing some stuff up but we want to make sure we thank our sponsors global ordinance who has all kinds of stuff you'll be able to look for a link down in the comments section for where you'll be able to get stuff from them that will help you support us by doing that so let's get on to the show as we prepared our demolition range for our recent video projects under strict labrador supervision as you can see we thought hey it's october we should really do something halloween themed then it hit us. Pumpkins. We scored a few at the local market, then began prepping them for an explosive demise. The first charge is the infamous Cricket Bomb, a CO2 cartridge with several grams of flash powder stuffed into it, made famous in our exploding mailbox video as it sent one into low orbit. We jammed a cartridge into the pumpkin, then lit the fuse. Let's see how the pumpkin holds up. It seems we discovered a fun new way of spreading pumpkin seeds all over our demo range. Not much is left of the pumpkin beyond a few chunks. The next charge is the tried and true Ordnance Lab classic, the Pipe Bomb. We managed to fit most of the pipe bomb inside the pumpkin. This pipe bomb has approximately 250 grams of ammonium nitrate based explosive. You can see in this slow motion video that there was nothing left of the pumpkin. The pipe bomb is obviously much more powerful than the cricket bomb. The third charge is a frag grenade with approximately 150 grams of a high explosive filler. For safety reasons, it is electrically detonated as using a 5 second pyrotechnic grenade fuse is not safe or practical. This blast was obviously not as big as the pipe bomb, but still atomized the pumpkin into a fine mist. It also threw shrapnel everywhere, as it is designed to do. For the next blast, we're using a stick containing 190 grams of emulsion explosive called Ready Prime, commonly used in mining and commercial blasting, as it has basically replaced dynamite. Despite being a relatively small charge, it reduced the pumpkin into puree and coated the GoPro blast shield with pumpkin goo. The last, but not least, blast is a 1 kilogram stick of TNT. This required a little bit more artistic enhancement, so we stuck the pumpkin onto a mannequin. Then we stuck the charge onto the side. The perfect long decoration for an Ordnance Lab style Halloween. Uh, well, hopefully y'all enjoyed that video. We went out there and blew a whole bunch of stuff up. And don't worry, these pumpkins have a rendezvous with Destiny along with Buddy Hair all over the place. Um, they were rendezvous with Destiny. We're going to be taking these out and blowing them up with some firecrackers and some other stuff. So we won't be returning them back to HEB. 
The big thanks out to our financial sponsors who have sponsored us on this through Patreon, PayPal, and a whole bunch of other ways. If you look down in the comments section, oh, buddy disappears into a literal, like, cloud of hair. Um, look down there in the comments section. You'll be able to see the uh, links for that if you want to support us. Again, we really appreciate everyone who's doing that, and we'll see y'all next time. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, be sure to hit the like button, hit subscribe if you want to see more, and stay tuned for another episode here at Ordnance Lab.